today I'll be reviewing this Mechanical Alliance Dark Commander. It was given to be my my brother to his nephews. And so this is so you can compare this model versus this. This is the $50 model with the semi-attachment in the back. One thing I'm missing is the gun, so I just bought a brought a little rep replacement gun. I won't be showing the transformation because I don't know how to do the transformation. But this is all, all the steps. I'm not a big Transformers guy. It's pretty cool. Definitely posable. It's a little loose. Depending on how you hold it, I'm loose like this. But that's why they make it posable. Just trying to get it stand. Compared with this, this one you can move the leg, but it's lower. About the same height. A lot more parts on this one versus this one. Let's look at the hands. The hands don't come out. They're just fixed like most toys, but they'll fit your standard gun. Of course, this is just a standard gun. It's not the one that came with the toy set. I don't know where it went. So you can see over there. Uh, unlike this one, where the hands don't come out, or they don't, you can't move them much. This one, this comes out. So you can close it and open it. So you can see over here, this one, versus this one. Another difference is, with these two, is this one, oh my gosh, allows you to put in the matrix of leadership. You can see I broke the leg over there. But unlike this one, it opens up and there's no compartment for the matrix of leadership. So the legs are a little loose. Maybe I just got a, a one that with, had loose legs. The arms are loose also. Let me bring this over. See the arms they move very freely. So I'm having trouble standing it up because it keeps on moving. This one's loose too, so you can see I'm trying to keep it up with the gun, but it won't stay up. It keeps on falling down. So, so far that's a little difficult. But you can see the range of the arm. This one's tight. This part's tight. But, you can see, I need a way to make this hold a little better because I can't pose it like this. I just can't pose it. The gun keeps it coming down. Again, this leg. Move this over. Leg keeps on wanting to do splits. See? So, that's the difference between buying. Hasbro, and this, uh, oh, I'm not sure who makes this one, but I'll find it on the box. 
Here's from the back. Nice. And you compare the back, this back, with this back. We'll do more close, close up stuff. Put the heads. Some more detail to the head on this one, sort of. This one's cleaner. Anyways, both sets are cool. You can see I just lost my leg over here. I'm not a big toy guy. I just wanted to show the collection. I mean, just show this toy because I have it lying around. And so, again, I want to pose this gun up, but it won't stay up. Comes down. There you go. Move the head a little bit. The head is a little tight. There you go. Pretty cool. And of course, I didn't transform it. That's for another video, but enjoy.